Hello guys, welcome back to another gaming video with TMD. Today's video is from Wolf Thunder, and we are playing on the map Jungle. And yes, I have been joining up in a squad with a friend. Let's just call him the General. I'm going to use my Kiwi 2, and the General is going to use his SC 152 to begin with. The plan is uh, to hold the main road that leads up to base A and make sure no one can pass us or reach the bay A when we are. But you can, of course, reach the base by going up behind it. But uh, we're going to let our team and the uh, AI to deal with, with them. Uh, in this game, a lot of, lot of players was actually using the main the main road, so uh, you're going to see a lot of action. And due to the lack of Wolf on this replay system, I won't be able to show you the enemy or the allies properly. You're probably going to wonder what's going on in some situation. I will try to guide as best as I can, and uh, you won't even see the capture bar and get a feeling how the game is going but uh, as I said I will try to guide as best as I can and yes I should have been recording this game live but I didn't but I hope you enjoyed the game anyway looks like the general already have found a target but it didn't kill the guy and instead he's taking return fire and uh, loses tracks and I think it was an SC-1 to do as well And there he is. Yes, it's an SD-152. Let's see if we can kill him. He's dead, but he managed to hit my gun and gun mount him, and uh, injure my gun. And now I see it. Five is shooting at me, but the general has the various cracks, and I'm going after him. And yeah, this is one with one shot. I'm reloaded and moving up. Let's see if we can spot anything. This looks like the enemy team has two teams in the square. And the one I was talking about was a team in the 4A with a HE shell. And now the other team with the 4 is shooting back on me. Not only hits my turret, I'm doing zero damage. And now the yellow is moving forward. See if we can take out that TV. But he missed the T 54 and now he's going to shoot back at us instead. And now I'm moving forward again and see if we can take him out instead. But I managed to spot a much danger attack man, so I'm so gonna take him out instead. And while I'm back up to reload, I get to move forward here to take my spot. And I miss the T 34 again. And now the T 34 has killed him instead. And while the general is respawning, it's up to me to hold the flank. It's time to go forward and see if we can take out the T-24 while not playing. It seems like she's shooting at AI tanks. But now he's turning his gun towards me and my damage a fuel tank and an Before I managed to kill him once and for all. Now I'm going to back off him and repair the things I can repair, and also wait for the general to arrive in his cave too. And there he is. going in straight away. And one shot a pencil for 
Auf F. And while he's backing off to the low, I'm moving forward. And I found myself another T-4485, which I one shot. And our other place for the team has arrived as well. A T-34 and a Tiger 1, which can come in handy. The Tiger managed to march at the Pulse 4 ounce F, but the T-34A5 managed to march at the Tiger. And while we in general are reloading, more allied tanks are coming to assist us. But we have the situation in control here and managed to stop almost every enemy tank and AI tanks that have been trying to map this road. It's time to go forward once again and see if we can spot anything. Until the barrage has been called in on someone, and I think I was shooting the T 4485 here. I was thinking the Tiger Hunter, but I missed him, so I'm falling back to reload again. And generally going forward. Uh, he found himself a cave too. He takes the shot, but probably didn't damage him. Now it's my turn. I'm going forward to see if I can do any damage with cave too. And yes, I know it's a headset on my left side, but we can't have an enemy cave too alive around here. Instead of going after us, the hatchy driver decides he's going to try to keep the base above us instead. But the hatchy driver didn't have a good day. An ally Panzer 4 out G took him up with a single shot. Down. And finally, the general managed to get the kill on that KV2. And the thing that probably happened was the general was probably damaged his gun, so when the enemy KV2 was shooting, it was destroyed itself. And the replay system decided to crash on it, so uh, it did remove a few seconds and it didn't miss anything special. And now we decided to push forward so we have a clear view over the bridge. And we have a few ally tanks on the right here supporting us as well. And now the enemy is pulling in after but after all over the place. There's the bridge leads to the enemy's spawn point. And once again, I managed to find myself a T-3485. And I'm pretty lucky with that shot, that's a long range shot with a KV2. And this game is almost over. Uh, we have already won the game, which you can't see on the capture board, unfortunately. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. The dark counts in War Thunder. And as always, thank you so much for watching. And as I said in my last video, I have started streaming, but it's going to be very random at the beginning. But I will stream every Friday evening, if nothing else is uh, showing up. And of course, more than welcome to check out the channel. You found the link in the description below. Once again, thank you for watching, and if you liked the video, go ahead and give it a like below. Or leave a comment. Uh, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss anything. I'm TMD, and hope to see you in the next one.